Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I thought I would film a get on ready with me, kind of like my nighttime skincare routine. Just because I feel like I've done my skincare routine before, but I've never shown you guys how I actually go ahead and take off my makeup. And for someone like me, who is constantly wearing, you know, a full face beat, how you take off your makeup to make sure it's fully gone is a huge key into how I sustain my clear skin. But can we just take a minute for this beat though, guys? I'm wearing blue contacts for the first time and I'm kind of feeling it kind of feel like it's a vibe so yeah grab your coffee grab your snacks and let's get rid of this look together <laughs> first thing I'm gonna go ahead and do is just take off these lashes I'm about to <laughs> Real quick, that simple. I don't know why I'd be making faces like that. I'm done with myself. I could have given you guys that cute, like, take off my lashes. But we all know that's how we be looking, like, when we snatch our lashes off. We'd be like... <laughs> so I just put them back in their case, you know, so they're nice and secure and ready for another day. Next, what I'm going to do is just go ahead and take some wet wipes. And you can honestly use whatever wet wipes you like. And I'm just going to go ahead and rub off my lipstick. So the next thing that I've been really loving lately is this Clean Green Makeup Melt Away Cleansing Balm. It's by Pharmacy and it's really bomb. Shout out to my sis Jenna for raving about this because girl, you did not lie. It is so fire. I've been loving this because it melts away all of your makeup so I don't have to use as many wet wipes or Marcilla water on cotton pads as much anymore. This melts it off really good. So I'm gonna go ahead and just scoop some of that up. It comes with a little scooper. So I just scoop some of that up and I just start working it onto my face start melting away that makeup I'm starting to look really crazy but this is how it be like guys at the end of the night you know you got to get that all off I just realized I forgot to take out my contacts you know what I'll do that in a sec <laughs> oh my gosh guys that's how you know I don't wear contacts because I completely forgot I'm just gonna go ahead get that eyeshadow melted off bruh <laughs> Crazy. So then I just go ahead and grab a warm face towel and I'm just gonna literally rub it all off And then I go in with my cleanser and it's also by pharmacy and this is their clean be ultra gentle facial cleanser This video is not sponsored by pharmacy or anything I went to an event that they had here in Toronto a little while ago They gave out all these products for us to try So sometimes you know you might get products and you actually really love them and you stick with them or they stick with you You know what I mean? That's just how I've been feeling about their products still forgot to take off my contacts Oh my god, but yeah now I'm just gonna go ahead and rinse this all off and I'll be right back So now I'm gonna go ahead with some some Marcilla water on a cotton pad just because I don't know if you guys can see but I have some areas right here where I still have some lash glue that hasn't come off yet so I just go ahead with a little bit of that our cleansing balm really melted off all the makeup so I don't really have to use as much Marcilla water anymore I just use it to get off all the lash glue on my eyelids if that makes sense so I'm just gonna go ahead and try to clean that off and then as you guys can see on this cotton pad that's all the leftover lash glue and everything on our lash line that I was able to get off and now that my face is completely clean I'm gonna go in with my toner and this is by milk makeup this is their matcha toner and you guys know I've talked about this in previous videos before I've been loving this toner ever since I got it like it's so bomb I haven't been using anything else I just love the glow it gives my skin so I'm just gonna go ahead and roll it all on and that's one of my favorite parts about this toner it's so convenient you just roll it all over your face and once it's all rolled onto my face I just start to pat it into my skin so now that we have our toner done I'm gonna go in with another product from pharmacy and this is their honeymoon glow it's an AHA resurfacing night serum this is really good for people who have texture AHAs is something you should definitely not use when you're going out during the day or anything like that because the Sun can cause sunburn and stuff like that so it's really good that you guys use this at night so I'm gonna take a little bit of that as I told you guys before I have a lot of texture right here and it's been helping like I swear my texture right here hasn't been as smooth since I started using this so I'm so excited to see where my skin will be a few months from now if I continue using it and I've just been loving the changes it's made in my skin like I can definitely see a difference as you guys can see my skin is already glowing and we're not even at moisturizer yet like do you guys see that I mean, and now I'm gonna go in with my moisturizer and this is from Bobbi Brown and this is their vitamin enriched face base I don't even know what to tell you about this moisturizer, but it's fire and I love using this moisturizer at night because it's so thick and hydrating that when I wake up the next day, my skin is so glowy, guys. It's everything. I've been obsessed with it ever since I got it. So I'm just gonna go ahead with a little bit of that. 
So the next product that we have is this Bobbi Brown eye cream. Guys, ever since I got this eye cream, I'm so shook. It's so moisturizing, it's so hydrating. Like immediately when I put it under my eyes, I'm just like, wow, wow, wow. I don't know what you're doing, but you're working. <laughs> It's called their eye repair cream. So I just go in with a little dot of it and I just start to pat, pat, pat underneath my eyes because remember, we don't want to drag it because that creates more premature lines. I know I'm that girl saying that, but guys, nobody wants to be in their 20s with a whole bunch of wrinkles underneath their eyes. Let's be real. Be very gentle with your under eyes because it's like the thinnest layer of skin that we have. So I just pat, pat, pat. And last but not least, lips because we don't want no chap lips. We don't want to wake up, you know, with our lips just looking a hot mess. I'm going to go in with this pharmacy honey butter bee wax lip balm so i'm just gonna go in with some of that but yeah guys that is pretty much my nighttime skincare routine that is how i strip my face of all of those impurities from the makeup i give my face a good 10 minutes to absorb all of the moisturizers and everything let it really seep into my skin before i lay on my pillows and stuff like that because i kind of feel like once you start laying on your side like most of that moisturizer just goes on your hand or on your pillow and it didn't really absorb into your skin you know what i mean so i give my face a good 10 minutes let that sink in, you know what I'm saying? And that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this little get on ready with me. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below what your nighttime skincare routine hacks are. I would love to hear what you guys incorporate in your skincare routine. I know it could be easy to fall asleep in your makeup and everything like that, but please don't because it's just not good for your skin. In the long run, it's gonna jack you up, it's gonna age your skin more, it's gonna give you more acne, all of that stuff. You just don't want it, sis. I know it takes a lot of effort, but just take the time to clean your face. Listen to a good podcast, find a video on YouTube, watch something, get your mind occupied, give yourself that little self-love, okay? And take care of your skin. <laughs> I'm actually so extra, I'm done with my Myself. But yeah, key message, take care of your skin, guys. And also make sure you guys subscribe and join the family. It would really mean a lot to me if you did. Thank you again for watching. And like always, I'll see you guys in my next video.